All right, I'm here from Crozier Gymnasium with the head coach of the North Landover girls basketball team, Jess Davini, coming off a big 68-60 to 60 win over the Drake Admitties and getting win number seven on the season. Uh, so, Coach, first things first with a win, you know, just talk about what went right. Uh, we made our free throws. Uh, we were 31 for 39. It's a, it was a lot of opportunities to put our free throws in, and we did it. We were about 79% from the free throw line, and that definitely um, made us victorious. So it was great. It was awesome. They put those free throws in. Now, I noticed early on um, with defensive uh, adjustments, you really uh, cracked down on, on that full court press. And it really worked well in the beginning. You know, I, I think you had a couple buckets, you know, really just to start that, you know, that first quarter. But then you made the adjustment, you know, kind of kick back in, uh, in the second half. And really, that worked too. Yeah. So can you just talk about the defensive adjustments you made today? Yeah, we really have been focusing a lot on team defense and, and what we need to do to be the best together, working together as a unit on defense. And the girls have been practicing that 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 press and um, and just the the whole concept of team defense. And they really just dialed in and uh, really did a nice job working together, um, getting stops when we needed stops, boxing out every time down the floor. And I was really proud of them. I, you know, that's a strength of ours is our defense. So proud of them today. I hate to criticize, but I think the referees really breathed through their whistles today, uh, I think they called, a, uh, let's just say, a lot of fouls. Um, so in a game like that, when you have a lot of players picking up fouls as the game goes on, how do you really manage that? Yeah, well, luck luckily I have a lot of kids that can come off the bench and, and give us good minutes. Um, I think that, you know, just making sure that we're strong with the ball when maybe we're, maybe when the other team is coming at us and attacking us um, and being able to, to have different matchups in there and have different people that can match up against their players um, you know, it, it definitely wasn't easy. <laughs> um, it, it wasn't easy in terms of, of um, the substituting and, and, you know, staying within our, our kind of routine when we had so many uh, people in foul trouble, even in the first half. So our post players were in foul trouble in the first half, but we, we worked through it and, um, and we got that W, like you said. Always good. A win is a win. Um, la lastly, I talked to your three captains just a couple minutes ago and they said their goal for the rest of the season, well, the state tournament obviously is in play, but they said they want to reverse the record from last year. They want 15 wins this season. Uh, what are your thoughts on that? Oh, I love that determination. That's fantastic. Um, you know, we set out each day to get better as a team, um, and and we've been doing that. And and from last year till this year, we've made a lot of great progress. We're moving in the right direction, and I have no doubt that we could go 15 and five. Um, we've got so a lot of great opponents coming up. Some that we've beaten, but I know that they're going to be breathing down our backs. You know, we start Sunday with Tuxbury, who we beat with three seconds left in the game last time. So it's going to be a great matchup, but we just got to get out there and give it all we got. Heard it here first. Hope to get that, that 15 win and, you know, anything's possible. Anything's possible, for <laughs> sure. Exactly. But, Coach, thank you very much for coming on with me, and congrats on win number seven on the season.